Sikhs are finding it hard to relax. Even here on Kavaori Beach, the debt crisis is weighing on everyone's minds. Many feel the lenders have treated them unjustly. It's not the money only, it's, uh, it's about respect. And, uh, you know, you cannot uh, think that this is independent, uh, the financial status of uh, respect uh, of one's way of life. So this is what is, uh, I'm, I'm very concerned. I think the currency is not the main thing. I mean, I can live without the euro. People are demoralized because they can't even access their own money. Cash is in short supply, along with patience. I don't want to be mean. I love my country. Unfortunately, the governments have brought the country to the brink of destruction. The poor youth, one and a half million unemployed who live on their parents' pensions. What will happen to these poor children? The strain on Greece has lasted five years. That's when the first bailout package was agreed. 73 billion euros flowed to Athens from its European partners and the IMF. Two years later came a second bailout and a haircut for creditors of 107 billion euros. And in 2015, the ECB has given Greek banks emergency liquidity assistance totaling 89 billion euros, making a total of 412 billion euros in five years. That's more than all the other debt-stricken Eurozone countries put together, yet the situation in Greece remains dire.